because it's not just a place for tourists to come, but they really focus on taking care of their animals and having them reproduce so they can keep the population growing. This is my first time meeting an elephant and I still can't believe it's real. One, they're huge and they're so friendly and they're just the most majestic animal. And they have babies and the babies roll around and they want to wrestle with you. I keep having to remind myself that this is a real thing. So when we first got here in the morning, uh, the owner talked to us and a group of tourists about his organization and what they do and why it matters. Rescue is only the beginning stage. Importantly, after rescues, it's what we call health recovery management package. It doesn't matter what happened to the elephant before. Once they're rescued, they do have right to be recovered healthier as far as their health condition, knowledge, technology, infrastructures, budget, allow them to be healthy. Essentially, he wanted us to leave this place um, and look at elephants differently. So that when we first saw them, we didn't just want to snap pictures, we wanted to check them for their health. He taught us how to do a head-to-toe examination of the elephant. Um, from its toenails to looking at the dirt on the side of it to see if it slept enough the last night. In the way elephants sleep, they don't sleep four hours straight. And you have to do both sides. One of the most interesting um, and different parts about this camp is that they actually have a health clinic here. And the vet we got to meet um, explained to us kind of what they do and showed us the more traditional medicines that they use and then also uh, the modern medicines that they use. So it's cool because they definitely mesh the two to care for the elephant. And something that she let us do was take vitamins and put them inside bananas so that we can like feed them to the elephants. They use tourism as a means to get income to fund their organization and essentially just take care of the elephants as best as they can. We also learned that taking elephants um, on walks through the forest is actually super good for them. You can also walk beside them, but it's a really good exercise and if they're healthy and socialized already, it's mutually beneficial for the tourists and for the elephant too. Probably one of the best parts of the day is when we got to give our elephants a bath. We each got our own elephant or shared an elephant with someone. So then we walked the elephant into this river where we got to scrub it down and then splash water on it. And it was so, so fun. And our mahouts helped us get on top of the elephant. And then we rode on them all the way back to the camp through the mountains. And it was the most beautiful thing. <laughs> <laughs> I knew I was going to come in today and ride an elephant and touch it and see it and that I knew was going to be amazing but I had no idea how much the experience of hands-on learning and actually being able to understand how well this farm preserves and cares for the elephants has been truly an experience I'll remember for the rest of my life. Thank you.